load driver okay no drivers was found then it's probably the wrong USB pen And search again. No dramas was found. What the fuck? Oh, alright. Good. Removable disk. Expand. Nothing. Oh, good. No. What the? This is. This is my installation drive. Maybe this one. No. Maybe this one. Let's see. What the heck? Just gonna find the other one again. <laughs> Alright, I just found it. This is the real one. So we're gonna push load driver and then uh what the heck is that in English? Advanced or no? Well just the one to the left. Um E drive, that's mine, but yeah. The drivers driver disk thirty four bit okay. And I have it. This is actually also a newer driver than the one I had. This driver enables uh, trim in RAID 0. And the driver I just had uh, before just doesn't support it. So I have the real driver now. And then I'm gonna take next. And it is installing it. Whee! Whee! Uh, what take? Alright, I just think this is a uh, notification. Alright, so I got the Windows file, I got the drivers loaded, and if you didn't do this before, you should just, just be able to update. And then it will come. After you load the driver, and you just gonna take next, and you are done. This is the power of two Corsair Force DGs: 1,100 megabyte read and 1,000 megabyte write. But I don't know if that's gonna make a big difference in Windows installation because Windows probably have a limit or something. For how fast it can be installed. However, it looks that way. Okay. Well, um, actually, the review is done. As it goes okay, pretty fast actually. In about yeah. From now on, it shouldn't take more than one minute, and that is actually really fast for a Windows installation. Installation. All right. Well, I'm done. Um, if you have any uh, comments or problems, I am really better in writing English than speaking it. So, um, well, give me a reply. Let me know what you think of the video, and uh, remember to subscribe. Bye bye.